Global Safety Council presents Dealing with Drug and Alcohol Abuse for Managers and Supervisors. Hello, I'm Don Dawson. Today we are going to discuss how you, as a supervisor or manager, must deal responsibly with drug and alcohol abuse in your workplace. As a manager, you need to respect an employee's private life. But what if one of your workers had too much to drink last night? Or another worker smoked some dope over the weekend? How about the employee who has been taking medications that could impair their ability to work safely? When substance abusers arrive at work, they don't leave their problems at the door. What these employees are doing both on and off duty could cause them to have a serious accident. Substance abuse is a huge worldwide problem. In the United States alone, there are over 50 million binge drinkers, 17 million illegal drug users, and almost 15 million people who abuse prescription medications. Most substance abusers have jobs. In fact, it is estimated that one out of every 10 workers has a substance abuse problem. So it's likely that your company will employ a substance abuser at some point. An employee with an alcohol or drug problem can decrease productivity, create a hostile work environment, and damage your company's good name. Worst of all, the actions of a worker who is under the influence can completely undermine your company's efforts to keep people safe. Substance abusers have more than three times as many accidents and injuries as typical employees. They use two times the amount of medical benefits and file more than twice as many workers' compensation claims. As a result, it is estimated that higher insurance rates, damage to equipment and materials, and other expenses related to alcohol and drug use in the workplace cost American businesses over $100 billion every year.